All right, that's a little better, right, guys? I got the light on. Um, it's bright as hell, so might need to get a, like a cover or something for the actual bulb. But um, yeah, um, I'm here with a what do you want to call it? <laughs> um, book mail. Um, or no, I just did a book mail. Um, I'm here with an ebook haul, and I got some audiobooks, so this should be awesome. Um, Alright, so the first audiobook, I'm just jumping into this, guys. Um, the first audiobook I got, I don't know if I, you know, know I got this book, but Worms by James R. Montague. Um, I have three and a half hours left um, of the book. That's the book I'm listening to for Richard's um, readathon, which is to read a book older than 31 years. And Worms came out in like 79 or something like that. Um, so I'm listening to the narration and it's hysterical. I, I can't wait to review it. So yeah. Um, okay, the second book I got was Ghostland by Duncan Ralston. Uh, apparently Lula wants into my room. Um, <laughs> yeah, Ghostland by Duncan Ralston. I'm just rifling these off because I don't have a description for you guys. So, and I don't have, I can't put the pictures up on the screen, so I feel bad, but um, maybe I'll splice it, I probably won't splice it, I'm just being honest with you guys, but um, yeah, just listen to what I'm saying and go look this stuff up. Duncan Ralston is a friend of mine, and um, not only did I buy some, a signed copy from him, well, I'm going to buy a signed copy from him, uh, I decided to go out and get his uh, audiobook which is Ghostland by Duncan Ralston. So, yeah. Uh, then I got uh, the Best Horror of the Year volume, I think it says 8 here. Um, oh, there's a book details. Yeah, this is volume 8. Um, it's uh, edited by Ellen Datlow. Um, so I can tell you the synopsis is for these things. My bad. Hold on one second. Mm, sorry, guys had to sneeze um so yeah uh best horror of the year volume eight then i got clown in the cornfield which you've been hearing a lot about that on youtube lately um by adam cesar or, C or i don't know how to say his name everyone calls him adam caesar one person corrected me and said it's Adam cesar or cesier but i'm gonna say it's adam caesar because i'm just gonna go with what everyone else says Planet in a Cornfield by Adam Caesar. Uh, I have something playing in the background, so I apologize. Um, there we go. Uh, Terminus by Peter Kleins. The Great and Secret Show by Clive Barker. Who Goes There by John W. Campbell. I don't know if I told you I got this or yet or not, but October by Michael Rowe. The Suicide Motor Club by Christopher Buhlman. And that is it. So, yeah, I'll put at the end of this video a bunch of pictures of the um, books that I got for audio. Um, none of these are for review. I'm going to review them, but they're, none of them are for review. I just bought them out of my own pocket. Either that or I borrowed some uh, credits from my mom. Um, but, yeah, I, I still have, I think one uh, credit left I think yes I have one credit left and I'm trying to figure out what book I should get I want something kind of gory so uh, if you guys have any uh, suggestions for a really good gory uh, audiobooks let me know um, but that has been a list of the books I got uh, for audio <laughs> Like I said, I'm reading or listening to Worms by uh, James R. Montague, which is so much fun so far. Um, it's in first person too, so yeah, you don't usually get really good first person narratives, so that's really awesome. Um, well, actually, I take that back. Every first person narrative I've read so far has been great, you know, so novel wise or novella wise. Um, but yeah, uh, that is all I have to say. That is my ebook haul. Um, I don't believe I got. Any actual ebooks? Let me go check real quick um, because I don't think I did that. Uh, I haven't gotten any books for review lately, so um, 
yeah, I didn't get any ebooks, so yeah. So that's it. Um, that's my uh, electronic book mail or not mail. See, I'm not really good at these videos today. I apologize, but I am really tired. Uh, my medicine's not working today, apparently, and uh, I, my energy drink hasn't worked today either. So, but like I said in the last video. I have three boxes ready, all behind the laptop. Um, I will be doing the, I forgot to mention this, but I will be doing the giveaway very soon. So if you are not entered in the drawing for a raffle or whatever you want to call this, this giveaway, um, go to my 200 sub video. That in the comments there, you leave a comment and you're automatically in. So it, the video has uh, a green space background. Sorry, I'm spitting everywhere. A green space background with Chester on it, and it says 200 sub giveaway. Um, go leave a comment, and you will be entered into the contest. Um, I will be doing the drawing probably either today or tomorrow, so you don't have much time to enter if you are not already entered. I think there's uh, 15 people entered, I think. Um, so it should be a good one. I'm doing the spin of destiny or the wheel of destiny So no one can I'm gonna record it too. So you know, I'm not cheating Because um, I felt bad because in my last one I drew names and it happened to be two booktubers So, you know probably everyone was like, oh, of course, it's gonna be booktubers. It's gonna get you know <laughs> Anyways, I'm, I'm gonna do the wheel of destiny this time and I'm gonna record it and you guys can see the winners um I'm hoping that you have to also, I forgot to mention this, you have to be in the United States of America in order to get this, uh, this giveaway. So if your address is not in America, then you are not qualified to win. So I apologize, but I do not have the shipping money to, to ship you, it to you, you know, I may consider Canada, I may, uh, it's like 10 bucks to ship stuff to Canada and and it's like 10 like five bucks to ship stuff in the US but other than that it costs a lot of money so I apologize to anyone out of the US I know you probably are used to this by now but yeah you have to be in the US to qualify um like I said the first box is the best box um there is a lot of cool goodies in the first box I need a bigger box to package that in but um yeah um yeah the first box is definitely the one you want to win there are some other good stuff in the other boxes but i have to say the first box i did a really good job with so whoever wins first place um in the giveaway you're gonna get a really good box um i'm crossing my fingers for all y'all <laughs> but uh yeah um that's it um I'll do a writing vlog in a minute here, but other than that, uh, I'll see you in the next video, guys. Have a spooky night. Peace out. Now I am become death.